or what do you what do you believe the intrinsic value is? I like to look at some other companies that have disruptive technologies um, that don't necessarily have revenues yet. And you can find some of those like Oklo, which mm -hmm. is in the nuclear, nuclear. Uh, SMRs, small mm -hmm. ma modular, modular reactors. Uh, then we have companies like AST Space Mobile, mm -hmm. no revenues, but they have you know, satellites that can uh, connect to your phones and kill dead zones. Mm. Uh, so I'm looking at uh, companies that have solutions to big problems mm. and where do they trade? Um, well, multi-billion dollars. And nobody's asking when the revenues are going to come. <laughs> uh, so this is what we should be using as comparables. So, so w again, what gets us to be compared against that the proof of concept yeah for for people for, for well, exposure to exposure more people need to know about the company but the, at the end of the day the pilot has to work the demo has to work and then then you will be compared against those other companies yeah. but i also find it interesting with those other companies whether it's oclo or asd space mobile do they have any competitors Yes, mm. they do. Absolutely. Does Aduro have any competitors? Yeah. No. Because mm. they, yeah, because they patented. And the CEO, came, the CEO even came out and said, "We don't have any competitors. We have companies that we can work with, but we don't really have any competitors because if less than ten percent of plastic is being recycled, right? 